Have you ever felt a uh, competitiveness from other actors at auditions? And if so, how do you handle that? Suppose you walk into a room and there's like 10 of you there. Mm -hmm. How do you keep that game face on so that you don't let them... I mean, it's just human nature to probably feel insecure. I, you know, I think it's kind of silly for actors to be to be competitive with each other. I mean, everyone's nervous in that situation and the audition room has a unique kind of uh, tension to it anyways. But, you know, you're really not competing against each other, you know? You're kind of competing against yourself. And so I think when people do get competitive, they try to psych the other person out, you know? And I think that's just kind of dirty. But from my experience, I don't think guys, I don't think men do it very often, but I've heard that females in, in the audition room can, can kind of get kind of nasty, some of them. I think they feel a little bit more competitive than, than dudes, don't you think? Yeah, I haven't experienced too much. I, every once in a while I've seen somebody in an audition room doing something so odd and kind of obnoxious that I mm. thought to myself, maybe that guy's trying to psych everybody else out or distract me or do something like that. Uh, but no, typically, I agree with you that it's m more everybody's kind of in their own universe and, and they're nervous for their yeah. own reasons and they're, you're more trying to do your own thing as best as you can possibly do it. Um, and. Uh, like There's it. enough ways that people are going to self-destruct on their own. They don't yeah. need help from anybody else in audition. Auditions are incredibly stressful, difficult situations. I feel like most people are <clears throat> worried enough about their own thing, or at least concentrated enough on their own thing, to not be thinking about how to mess up the guy next to you. It's yeah. just sort of... Uh, I at least actually, in my experience, but maybe, I don't know, maybe you and I... I would like it. if it was more competitive. If they were like, alright, we're going to bring you guys in, alright, now you do it, alright, now you do it. I, he take just your, did it take your tops off and fight. <laughs> when you're done with that, we'll go in the audition room. I, I like to come out of the audition room and be like, all right, great. No, I'll have my agents <laughs> read the contracts then. All right, I can't wait. Please, I'll see you, you guys on set. That does happen. Good luck, there, everybody. There, hey, there, good luck, everybody. There is some psych out that goes on with like the guy who walks out of the room. Everyone's uh, watching what he's doing. You no, know, there's a guy who comes out with his sides and he immediately throws him in the trash. <laughs> just throws him in the trash and goes storming out. And you're like, okay, well, that maybe didn't go so well. Yeah. Then there's the guy that comes out and he's just so smart. He's like, all right, guys. Huh? Everybody? Great. Break hey, a leg, guys. Break a leg. Break a leg, right? Break a leg. You're like, oh, fuck you, asshole. Uh, but you know who you are. You know who you are, break a leg guy. Stop saying it. <laughs> Stop saying it. That's it. So what's your process when you do leave after you hear great work, great job, thank you, we have your information? Do you obsess I over tweet it? it instantly. <laughs> I tweet, going to gym, had rocked that audition. Just cried internally. Uh, I don't know. Just degraded myself. I have definitely have been that guy that walks out and has like ripped the pages oh, you know, sure. on my way out. Sure. And, and I book that job sometimes. I have. It's, uh, yeah, yeah. You know, you just, you just don't know. It's so awful sometimes as an actor, you know, walking into a room. It's like having a job interview. That's what I equated to. I think everyone, most people can understand what a job interview is like. But it's one of those job interviews where they say, oh my God, you're perfect for this job. You have the wrong hair color, so you can't be the president of the United States, kind of thing. Um, and it's, it's kind of depressing in, in that way, but it, um, I think you train yourself as an actor to once you walk out that door, you forget about it. You totally, I've been called and said, I don't hey. I how good you are at that. You I'm had, good at that. I've, had, I've been called and be like, I you, you had an audition, you got that job. I'm like, what job? And like, it's for this movie. And I'm like, I don't remember what that was. And they're like, it's this. Remember you auditioned for it last week? And I have to like kind of go through my notes and be like, oh, cool, yeah, no, I remember that. Because I've trained myself to just not care. Because you, you, it will just eat you. you know? Oh, yeah, I'm, 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 I haven't, I've got to actually, you should maybe do a class that I could take and train <laughs> myself to not care. Because I still, I'm, I'm very tortured by the whole thing. I, Auditioning you know. for me is a horribly painful, difficult thing. I always say to myself, uh, and other people too, and now anyone who listen, um, that if and when I get to a point where I'm, you know, e creatively in control of a project in terms of casting and hiring people, that I just want to revolutionize the audition process because I think it's a totally, it's not a very constructive, it's, it's not very process, good. and you're not really finding the best people for the work. You're kind of just finding good auditioners, which isn't Some reflective are great of what, what, yeah, what the, yeah, what it's like on set. Yeah. On set. Yeah. yeah. So I'd just like to, I think the whole thing needs to change. I, I don't, I, I don't, I think it's, it's, it's gotten to a really weird place. I think people are also lazy with, um, on the other side of the camera, they're lazy with watching someone's reel, with watching someone's previous work. You know, I, I, I wouldn't 
hire somebody, you know, I wouldn't even ask someone to come in and, and take an interview unless I'd read their resume, you know, and, and kind of, you know, read, you know, if I was read some of the, the, the what they've done, you know. Um, I think it's it's kind of a, a lazy thing, and, and people just want to hear their own material coming out of that person's mouth, and I, I think that, you know, there's a, there's room for that, but I always equate it. It's like have auditioning is kind of like having a math teacher give an English test. You know, they're both teachers, but it's a whole different subject. You know. I'm waiting. I mean, I'm waiting to find out if one day I'm somebody who has to. Thank you. Thanks. Cool. That's not. Good. That's good. That's not distracting at all. Actually, this is. It's, there are a lot of sirens around here. Like yeah, so it's it's amazing. Amazing. yeah, I like to keep. But it I, I, I'm waiting to find out. Like one day, if I'm in that position where I'm you know, directing or producing something, and um, if and when, I, I'm waiting to find out that maybe there's a reason why the casting process is, to me, what seems very backward and weird, but. There, there might be a reason. I mean, I might be that guy sitting there thinking, like, I just don't have time to do this. I can't read everybody's resume. I can't watch your reel. I'm sure. trying to do things and just, you know, and 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 I don't care who the best actor is. I'm just waiting for someone to come in the room and not melt down. And you're right, right. you can have the role. I just need to get this movie made, you know. And I, everybody, I guess, is stressed out in their own way. But I, to me, right now, from somebody who strictly has seen the audition process from the point of the auditioner, uh, right, not the audition E. Am I the audition E or am I the audition er? I'm the audition E. Both. Well, the audition er is the person who's auditioning me, right? Yeah. And I am auditioning, so I am the audition E. Audition. Doesn't matter. Uh, from the point of view of the actor who's going in on, and auditioning, um, we'll just cut that out. Uh, Start now. And that's what I think. Um, yeah, it's it's it seems weird to me. I don't like I don't like the process. This was an audition right now. Oh, good. Did I get you the role? Did not. I get, get no, I didn't. Didn't get it. Didn't no. get it. Right. Do you have any, anybody have some sides I can rip up and throw in the trash? The, these were the sides. Oh, damn. You said every word wrong. Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs>